Hello everyone, welcome to the Bonsai Life. My name is Damir and today I will work on this Chinese elm. Uh, he is really kind of bushy, needs uh, a pruning. Like these branches are really laggy, needs hard, hard, hard pruning. I will take him really hard back. This pot is really small for him already. And I would like to expose this lower part of the roots if you can see them and I have uh, some of these new Chinese pots and they are, they are amazing uh, cracked, cracked glaze they, they are amazing like really nice pots they look so nice I will check which side is better This one have kind of one leg a bit more white. Here are the legs kind of the same and the colors are really nice. So this, this will be my front side of the pot. And I will take the tree out. I think the tree is wired there. It's full of roots. I cannot even take the tree out. Okay, here we are. The tree is totally packed. As you can see, it's like full of the roots. And the uh, Chinese elm are known that they, they, they grow like really a long roots. And I would like to expose all this so because that other pot is a bit bigger so that will be a bit more like possible so this is not actually uh, my creation this tree uh, was uh, a bought this was like uh, kind of a uh, dying tree in the shop and it was like really cheap and it had this like uh, kind of crazy shape uh, roots so I wanted to to make something like totally unusual with this with this kind of uh, roots. I think this tree is actually uh, uh, this is air layered uh, a branch. I think this was the branch and I think they had a branch growing like kind of you see like this and they air layered the part and because usually if this is uh, from China they, they, they don't care about the, the, the shape of the roots and things like that they just you know they just tuck this and put in the pot and here we go so I think that's the case of this tree and uh, anyway it's it's kind of uh, totally unusual and I was thinking I can make something like something uh, something interesting with this so now the thing is here I don't have any roots on this part like this part here should I cut it and and uh, should I make the roots here too that's that's the that's the questions now should I cut this part it's actually a living part so I think if I 
if I start this a bit, then then maybe I can get the new roots here. Yeah, it's it's living living part, so I think I can get the new roots on this part. I'm not gonna cut it off. So I have one root here. A long one, this one, growing from the bottom part, that I would like to shorten a bit. I have these leggy roots that I will shorten and now I don't know should I use this or no I think this part is not necessary I think this it would be like much nicer without this root this root is like kind of you know crossing this part so I will remove this root here like this so now I open this space a bit more so I wouldn't mind if this uh, let some roots but these roots are too long and I will cut some of these roots short these two I want all the roots to go down and I don't want them too laggy. I will redirect this root here and this one is growing kind of inside so I would like to go outside and this here is alive or no. This is that part this is that so I have pot ready and like I would like some roots here like here so I will take my scissors and I will just like make some kind of holes here with the scissors I think this part is, is like living part, it's, it's soft so like I think definitely you can get, this part is kind of hard so I think this, this here could be dry, I don't know, but this is definitely like soft, I think I can get some roots here. So I have lava rocks and my base layer of soil and now I will just put a bit of uh, hormones root hormones like this This is how it look like. Now I will I will just loosely uh, tie the tree. So now I will put the soil.
this will be definitely upgrade for the for the tree Just I need it here. So this is I don't know what should be the front. Both both sides looks good. This is this this side and I was thinking this as a front but the tree is leaning a bit to me this is like more inviting like the the tree but this is like the the, the roots and everything is more like kind of open on this side so both sides both sides looks good so i will just water the tree now and we will be back for the pruning so this will be my front side so i will prune the tree according to that but i will start on the top of the tree because the branches are really too long so i will start like with the like really hard pruning the tree will grow that's no doubt Chinese arms grows, they grow like crazy, especially in the summer, it will be even bigger in no time. This is the part of the top too, so this even more like this and I'm trying to prune with the directional pruning so I'm trying to prune so the leaves are going into direction I want if are some leaves there but I'm trying to leave some leaves. So I'm taking all the all the branches that that grows like back inside or see this branch grows like this. So this is like absolutely not usable branch. This needs to be 
much shorter. Here I have one branch that grows upwards and then one grows downwards but it's straight. So and then from that branch I have this so I will just like take a part of that branch. So this one is also quite straight so I will take the part of that one too. Here I have a stop. This bottom part is really weak. It would be the best just to leave this to grow like wildly. Like I will leave this just to just do whatever you want. Go be free. So now we have this this is quite thick branch for for uh, upper part of the tree and this is also kind of messy branch so I will take this here I, the branch is growing kind of inwards so I will shorten this I have a step here I will take this upper part growing this shorten this branch here like clump branch okay this one is going in the good direction but it's like really long And now, of course, this is like too big for the top, so let's take this short. And this is too thick for the top. This is also too long. This is going inwards, funny direction. This is too long. This is too long. This is too long. And this is definitely too long. Let me check now how we are doing. Much, much better. Now it looks like a tree. So we are back in business. But now these are a bit too long now. So just to shorten these a bit more. And here on 
this branch here it's like huge mess here these branches they they, they just don't they don't have any good flow this here this is going bad direction here this is that I think we are done just clean the fallen leaves and branches so I took a piece of moss and now I will cut this moss into tiny little pieces so I clean the moss from the from the substrate so this is just clean clean moss And I will just put the moss next to the the roots, so it will grow just like around the tree. So I think that 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 will that will look good. And if you want to make like really nice. Uh, carpet of moss this is the way how to do it that moss looks just totally different than later when when it starts growing it looks full nice and it's like nicely attached to the to the uh, soil just looks much better If you do a penjing or something like that, then then you should do do it like this. It looks just much better later on. So the tree is done. It's finished. I left this this bottom branch just to grow because I need that that branch much thicker than. Then, then I'm gonna prune it. Now it's it's actually like the thinnest branch on the tree, so it's a nonsense to leave that there, like that thin. So this is the tree. So I hope you like it. it looks really good. The moss will go green in few days. And it will look like a small green carpet around the around the tree. This is also something I don't need here. So I hope you like it. it looks quite good. The pot is pot is amazing. Pot is like pot looks really really cool. So if you if you like it same as me please thumbs up it means really a lot and thanks a lot for everything and we will see each other in the next video so bye bye have a nice day